In this video, we're going to take a quick look at a custom report in Daylight we've created for several clients that tracks user leave. Um, and this can be holiday allowance and also sickness. So first of all, there's a form in Daylight that is linked to each user um, that records their granted holidays. So their holiday allowance for the year is recorded in this form. And as some firms also allow um, a certain number of days for uh, community work or volunteering services. Um, you can also record volunteering days in here um, if you do offer that. And then finally, you link it to the Daylight user that you want to record it for. You can set it as private or as a custom permission so the other users can't go looking up how many um, days of leave each other is entitled to. So when that form is set up, next, when your user requests leave, you create a new appointment. Um, the appointment name can be anything you want, um, but you set the category to holiday, and you need to make sure that the user is the owner of the appointment. So either they can create their appointments themselves, um, and you have to approve it, or your HR person can create the appointments whichever way your workflows operate, but it needs to be set to holiday. Now under keywords, we've got a couple of different options. If, for example, it is a public holiday, a bank holiday, um, and these don't come out of the leave allowance, you can set a keyword there, so it shows as a holiday, it shows as time off, but it doesn't come out of the holiday allowance. Same for volunteering. If you offer volunteering or community leave, um, you can set that there. Um, and it doesn't come off the regular leave allowance, but it comes off the volunteering leave allowance. And if it's a sickness day, you can record it as a sickness day using that keyword, and then it allows you to track the number of sickness days your staff have. So then finally you set the user you're recording it for as the owner, and then you save the appointment. And then in reports in daylight, we have the user leave report. It's very simple to use. Um, you set the date you want to report on, so it can be the entire year, it can be a month, um, it can be next year, last year, if you want to look at holiday records. Um, you can choose which user to report on. So you can report on everyone, or you can report on just one user. So we're gonna report on John. And how many hours per working day? Um, if you, for example, allow half days, um, it'll take a half day figure off. Or if, for example, a person starts an hour late one day or finishes an hour early, you can record that and that'll come off their holiday allowance. So when you're ready, you just click go to run the report and it shows a breakdown for each user. Um, it shows their holiday allowance allowed, how many they've taken, how many are remaining, uh, their sickness days, if they have a volunteering allowance, it displays it there, how many of those taken, how many remaining. And if you click on the user, it'll show you the appointments for that user that they have booked off on leave. Um, and there's also a breakdown there. And then finally, down the bottom, there's a user manual. So if you are confused or you can't remember how to do something, you just click on the user manual and you can see the report there. So that's the LGO user leave report that we've created for several clients and um, if you're interested in it please contact us via our website www.lgo.co.uk um, it is available for purchase and we can also customize it uh, to suit your business's requirements